I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw Levi Strauss. I take three fingers way over here on the left and underneath I put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a curve line down over and leave it floating. Come back to the dot. We're going to draw another curve line down over and leave that floating. Come back on the left, we're going to draw a curve line out, in, connect. Come on the right, curve line out, in, connect. On the inside, we're going to draw a curve line, straight line, curve line, and leave that floating. And on the right hand side, we're just going to draw a curve line. Come underneath the left and we're going to draw a curve line up, down, connect, on the left, curve line up, down, connect, on the right. Come back to the left, draw a little curve line inside on the left and a little curve line inside on the right. Come over here on the left and we're just going to draw a little curve line on the left little curve line on the right. Come right here in the center, we're going to draw a curve line in, out, come back in, draw a slightly curved line up, over, and a slightly curved line inside. Come over here on the left and we're going to start drawing curve line down, 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 keep going, all the way up, a little bit more on the left, a little bit more on the right. Come back up to the dot, we're going to draw a slightly wavy line down on the right, slightly wavy line down on the left, little wavy line on the inside on the left, little inside wavy line on the right. Come over here on the left and we're just going to draw a straight line, curve line in. Come on the right, straight line, curve line in. Leave it floating. Right here in the center, let's draw a baby circle. And now we draw slightly curved line up, connect on the right, slightly curved line out, up on the left. Right at the center. One two little straight diagonal lines. Okay, come over here on the left and we're just going to draw curve line down off the page on the left, curve line down off the page on the right. Come right here and just draw a straight line, straight diagonal up, straight line, straight diagonal up. Okay, all right. Right above, we're going to write his name, Levi Strauss. And above that, we're going to write his quote. It's no use. They can't be ripped. So you might go, what are they talking about? Well, Levi Strauss was the first person to make blue jeans, which was very important if you were a 49er in the gold rush. So now over here on the right hand side, let's put a dot and we're going to draw a curved line on the left, bring it down and in and leave that floating. Come back to the dot, draw another curved line around and leave that floating. Come back over to this section and just put two straight lines. A big long straight line down, straight line, straight line up, leave it floating. Come on the right hand side, straight line down, 
curve line, straight line up, connect. Now this is a very important part. You're going to draw curve line, curve line, and now we're going to add a curve line to the left. We're going to add straight line, straight line, straight line. We're going to add another curve line over. These little tiny baby circles are the rivets and this is what made his blue jeans different than all the other work clothes the 49ers were using because it's no use they can't be ripped wherever there was a pressure point a stress point on the clothing he went ahead and put a rivet and that kept the clothes from ripping okay we're going to come up here on the right and we're just going to draw a slightly curved line slightly curved line and then little straight lines going up okay we're going to jump over draw another curved line straight line straight line okay they were all stitched so we're going to put little straight lines going around and up <coughs> excuse me now like I said you have to remember that this was during the gold rush so we're going to put 1850 even though the gold rush was the 49ers but we're going to write here I wrote it on the bottom let's put the gold rush so you don't forget why Levi Strauss was so important okay Let's see how we're going to color him in. Okay, if you have gray, we're going to give some bushy eyebrows in gray, and we're going to color his hair gray. And he was a German immigrant. So now we're going to come down and do this beard. He had a very distinctive beard. We're going to do it all gray. Okay, fill that in pretty intensely. All right, then we'll give him brown eyes. And if you have multicultural crayons, just so he doesn't look so white, this is apricot or peach. If you don't have that, you can just fill him in with a light brown, just so he doesn't look so white. And he was German and wore black suits. So all of this is black. This is black. This is black. He had that white shirt, as was the style back in the 1850s and this is all black okay then just get your blue out and color in your blue jeans now if you can try and not do the little baby circles those are the rivets we're going to color those a different color he was the first one to come up with this okay I used yellow but if you've got metallics you can use a bronze or gold for all these rivets and these are the stress points on the clothes they can't be ripped all right let's see what he looks like all colored in okay here's Levi Strauss with his blue jeans he was a German immigrant that came to San Francisco during the gold rush and made probably more money off of his blue jeans than some people did looking for gold. Okay, bye-bye.